Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel Orange Orang. In today's video, I will be sharing with you how I nail my third try in the Japanese driving exam. So as we all know, Japanese driving exam is one of the most difficult driving tests in the world. So um, yeah, not a lot of foreigners can nail the first try. So now I want to share with you how to pass the driving test in Japan. So this uh, course map is most likely the course map that you're going to see in the entire country of Japan. So, but this one, I think it's different from each area. So, uh, this is the course map in Yamagata. Now, as you can see, there are a lot of uh, arrows here. So, this is this is the starting point. Here's the starting point. So, this is your car. But before you get in the car, make sure that you follow the following important points. First is to check the car, 360 degrees. And look under the car, at the back of the car and in front of the car. Make sure that the policeman is saying what you're doing, okay? And then before opening the door, look around you as if as if you are in a busy street, okay? And check if there are cars coming in or pedestrian or whatever it is. Then, adjust when you go inside a car, adjust the seat belt. Um, not the seat belt, adjust the seat. Adjust the seat first. If you are a short, short person like me, you have to adjust the seat and uh, move it a little bit forward. But if it's okay with you, then don't adjust it, all right? So next is buckle up and uh, put on your seat belt and check if the instructor's seat belt is already fastened. So yeah, and if you are both okay, check and touch the mirrors, okay? So in my case, I had to adjust my side mirrors because I'm a short person, but if you think it's okay with you, then don't do it. But the most important thing is you touch the rear mirror, even if you don't need to adjust it, okay? Just, you know, touch the, the mirror, okay? The rear side mirror. Now, lock the door. Don't forget to lock the door and check the emergency brake, okay? And next is start the car, okay? Start the car and release the emergency brake and put on the right blinker, okay? Put on the right blinker. So that means you, you are uh, preparing to move forward or to pull forward, okay? And before you slowly pull forward, Check again your right side if there are cars coming in, okay? If there is none, then you can pull forward now. Oh, before you pull forward, by the way, I'm so sorry. Before you do it, before you move your car, before you move the car, do the full head spin or the five-point head spin. First is check your left blind spot, look over your shoulder, and then check your left side mirror, the rear side mirror, right side mirror, and then right side blind spot, okay? And then pull forward slowly. Now, you stay. Now, after you pull forward, put on the left blinker when entering the road, okay? So now you have to change your winker and winker or blinker, whatever it is. So turn on your blinker and go into the left, all right? I mean, your left blinker and stay in the left lane. Now, when, uh, when you are already at this point, you have to speed up like 20 or 30. But if you are going to enter the curve, don't ever, ever um, use your brake. Okay, just reduce your speed, slow down, and then enter the curve. So speed up again at this point, and then at this point, prepare to change lane by turning on your left blinker, and then look at the rear side mirror, rear side mirror, right side mirror, I'm sorry, right side, right side, right side blinker, not left, right side blinker, and then look at your uh, rear side mirror, right side mirror, look over your shoulder, and then if it's okay, then change lane, okay? Now, Reduce the speed, okay, slow down, slow down, okay, and check again your rear view mirror, and then check your right side mirror, and then the blind spot, okay? Always, always look over your shoulder, and then pump the brakes three times and slow down, and before the corner, check your blind spots with your eyes. Again, check, check, always check, and turn slowly, and then when you reach this point, you have to 30 meters, okay, 30 meters, you have to turn on your left blinker, and then slow down. Check your right. Uh, check your rear mirror, left side mirror, and then your blind spot. And then check left and right if there are cars coming in. Okay, don't forget to do it. Okay, you are already at this point. And if it's okay, then you can turn left. And if you already turned left, again, turn on your blinker and slow down. Check your rear mirror, right side mirror, and then right side blind spot. Okay, and then check left and right if there are cars coming in. Don't forget to stop. There is a stop line over here. Not slow down, but stop, like a full stop, okay? Check if there are cars coming in, and then turn right. Now, prepare to turn right again. So open your, or turn on your right blinker, and then slow down. Check rear mirror, right side mirror, 
check right meters, meters, and then blind spot, okay? Slow down, pump three brakes, pump the brakes three times, and then slow down, check if there are cars coming in, and then turn right. Now, when you reach this point, you have to do it again. Prepare to turn left, so turn on your left side blinker, and then look your rear mirror, left side mirror, look over your shoulder, and then check this side if there are cars coming in. So always do that, and then you turn left. Now, as you can see here, you have to stay on the left side. So stay on the left side, and then when you turn left here, you have to turn on your right blinker again as soon as possible, okay? And then slow down, check the mirrors, rear mirror, right side mirror over your shoulder, then change lane. And then prepare to enter the S-curve before you do that. Again, check the rear side mirror, right hand, right side mirror, and then over your shoulder. Look over your shoulder and then turn, go and enter the S-curve. When you enter the S-curve, be sure that you are not speeding up, okay? Slowly, 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 okay? Slowly, slowly. When you reach this point, you already, you should already turn on your um, right blinker, okay? Because you're gonna turn right here, okay? Now, of course, the blinker will turn automatically turned off. So you have to turn it on again. So turn on the blinker and then stop right here and check if there are cars coming in left and right, okay? So migi, hidari, migi. If there are no cars coming, then you can turn right here. And then when you reach this point, turn on your blinker again, going to the right side, okay? Turn on the blinker, look over, look to the rear mirror, right side, and then over your shoulder, okay? And here, there is a traffic, um traffic uh, lights there is traffic light there is a traffic light here so if you see the yellow traffic light you should stop and slow slow down and stop but if you see green light then you should slow down a bit all right check again your uh, rear mirror right side mirror and then over your shoulder and then look left and right migi hidari migi if there are no cars coming you can turn right and then keep right okay keep right now 30, 30 meters away, you have to turn on your blinker again, going to the right, so slow down right here, slow down, and then look over your shoulder, I'm sorry, look to your rear mirror, right side mirror over your shoulder, always like that, and then migi, hidari, migi, okay, no cars coming in, you can turn right, and when you turn right, after you turn right, open your blinker again, going to the right, okay, and then slow down, because you're going to enter the crank now, before you enter the crank, you have to slow down first and check if there are cars coming from your right side so again check rear side mirror right uh, rear side mirror right side mirror and look over your shoulder again and check if there are cars coming in in front of you opposite to your direction if there are none then you can go ahead and enter the crank so as much as possible don't fall to this area okay if you think that your one of your wheels are gonna fall down to this area then you have to reverse okay but make sure that before you reverse you have to check your surroundings, especially your rear mirror if there is a car before you, okay? So you have to do it and before you reverse. Now, if there are no cars before you, then you can reverse now and then adjust your wheel and then you can go ahead and um, exit the, the crank. Now, when you're at this point already, you have to turn on your left side blinker, okay? So left side blinker and before you turn left, again, check three points, rear side mirror, left side mirror, and then look over your shoulder and then check Migi, Migi, Hidari, Migi. If there are no cars coming in, then you can turn left now. Okay, and speed up, speed up, speed up. When you're at this point already, you have to turn on your right blinker. Okay, turn on your right blinker, then slow down, slow down. Then check right, check your rear mirror, left side mirror, and then look over your shoulder. Check the blind spot. So there is a stop line. You should stop. I suggest you stop like for three to five seconds. Migi, Hidari, check, Migi, and then you turn left okay so now you should slow down because this is a curve then you can now speed up speed up speed up speed up speed up then a little slow here because you have to check if there are cars here so slow a little then you have to turn on your blinker right here because you are now going to prepare to turn left so if you are already here turn left if you are already here you have to check your um, rear mirror, left side mirror over your shoulder, and then prepare to turn left, okay? And now, speed up a little, then turn on your blinker again going to the left side. So, you should slow down right here and check rear side mirror, left side mirror, and then look over your shoulder, and then turn left, okay? And then there is a stop light here. So, again, if the light is red, you should stop before the line, but if the light is yellow again you should stop 
slowly you should reduce your speed and stop if the light is green again before you go to the pedestrian before you go you cross the road again check left check right left right okay and then go even if the light is green okay that's one of my tips and then if you are already here turn on your blinker right away and prepare to change lane from left to right okay now you have to check again of course while you are driving check again your rear mirror your right side mirror over your shoulder and then change lane again so you have to do it again before you turn right so check rear side mirror right side mirror and blind spot right blind spot and then turn right all right so now you're gonna enter another curve so don't use your brake foot brake all right don't use your foot brake just slow down reduce your speed and then turn but as you can see there is another like um uh like a road here so maybe there are cars coming in so you have to look over your shoulder from to the to the left side okay look over your shoulder to the left side and then if there are no cars coming then you can go ahead and speed up and then turn on your blinker going to the uh left side right here okay so turn on your blinker to the left side and then slow down here then look over look to your rear mirror left side mirror and over your shoulder and then enter again this starting point okay so the instructor will tell you oh please park the car in number one number two or number three okay so here because you're going to enter the starting point again you have to slow down a bit slow down slow down and then when you're going to park the car here you have to turn on your right blinker and then again rear mirror right side mirror over your shoulder and then park all right and when you park please don't forget to put the car in the parking mode and then the uh handbrake or the foot brake all right all right and voila turn off the engine unbuckle and then check if the instructor will tell you something and then boom they're gonna tell you if you pass or not so i hope this video helps you a lot and thank you so much for watching my video about the japanese driving license uh test so thank you so much everyone and have a great night